Virgo, welcome back to the channel. I hope that the message finds you while you're in good health and good wealth. Let's see what Spirit has for you. We are going to be getting a message from the guides. This will be for any and all Virgo placements. If you want to follow me on social media, donate to the channel, book a personal. Links will be in the description box below. Spirit, what can you show me about Virgo? What messages do you have for Virgo at this time? Invite help is out first individuality and letting go all right virgo receiving you are in the energy of receiving something you're open to receiving you could be expecting something to happen or play out because of something you've done i don't know but we have invite help individuality and letting go some of you guys are starting to see just how um, the power within your individuality right you're focused on that you're definitely learning a lot right now and how your energy is it is one of one virgo what you bring to the table what you bring to the environment you find yourself in or relationships the things that you maybe overthink about yourself sometimes those are the exact things that people love about your energy about what you bring your individuality is special spirit is look the divine source is setting you up putting you in a position to receive your gifts are very needed your your magic you know and with invite help yes this could be you aligning with this source receiving divine source this card says invite the divine to pursue you seriously just say i'm finally ready god pursue me right spirit is trying to open up new doors for you Letting go of something is leading to receiving another thing. Okay. Everything is indeed out of control and God will hold it all. I can safely let go. Yeah, Spirit is encouraging you to open your energy up to receiving. Receiving information, downloads, guidance. Receiving where you're supposed to go next. Receiving your divine plan. Your individual divine plan. All right, what do you have for Virgo? Any messages for Virgo at this time? Maybe the Seven of Swords in the reverse. Or the Page of Pentacles. One more. Eight of Wands. There's definitely messages coming in towards you, Virgo. This could be someone communicating with you. But again, yeah, somebody really communicating with you. King of Swords or King of Cups could be a water sign or an air sign. With the Eight of Wands, it also could be Sagittarius. It doesn't have to be. But you're definitely receiving information that is going to help move you into some new environment. This is fast, coming in fast, or you're being shifted into a newer energy at a very fast pace. I don't know. There's definitely communication coming in and somebody new, potentially romance or work related because we have the page of pentacles and the page of cups. This could resemble your energy being in more of a receptive energy, right? Learning new, putting yourself in a position to grow. But there's a lot of new opportunities coming in towards you or a lot of new ideas. There's this desire to become knowledgeable about a new environment or something else something new that you want putting yourself in a position to learn learning lessons but luck is on your side as well i also see the six of pentacles in the page of cups so it tells me there's a good something that feels good to you is fair to you and um offers you it's like a light-hearted energy you know it's somebody that can meet you where you're at or you know the vibe is very good with this energy there's a good exchange of energy but i feel you receiving clarity on something or maybe trying to strategize clarity on what clarity on creating a strategy creating some sort of 
plan, right? Um, it's been revealed to you. That's what spirit could is definitely saying here. Spirit is somebody out there is receiving a download or has been receiving many downloads about where to go next and spirit is basically showing you how to do it that is what this is and you're on the path of basically learning new skills and finding maneuvering your way through these new opportunities and relationships and connections balance is very balance is here there's a good exchange of energy between two people and i do feel that this is you're going to need to be able to trust the universe you're going to need to be able to rely on the universe right and trust what you receive because you're you're not meant to do this alone i want to say like spirit is supposed to is really supposed to be with you on this path and yeah that's what i'm seeing what am i feeling I feel hesitancy from someone here to invite the help in that they need. You could be used to doing things alone, very comfortable doing things alone, but I see also the I see pushback between you and yourself, Virgo, of letting go of the need to do it alone and allowing the help to come in that allowing the help that you need to come in. Look, guidance and faith. You're definitely spirit is like trying to get through to a Virgo out there. Like, you don't have to do it alone. You don't have to do it all alone. It's okay to let go of whatever made you think that or feel that, right? You're being invited to new connections by spirit, people that will um, be like-minded, people that will communicate well and emotionally communicate well, you know what I mean? I feel the pushback from the trust. I feel a Virgo surrendering to it, though. I feel somebody surrendering to the process of what Spirit is trying to do for them in their life. Where's my pen? Oh, dang, this reading is probably all shaky. All right, we'll get you some last messages. Virgo, you're going somewhere new. Angel of past lives. Could be a lot of reflection at this time. You could be uh, reflecting on how you have, how far you've gotten and at a transition period currently. Where are you about to go next? Angel of health. Your health is in good, good condition. It's also just a reminder about health and all the things that involve health, right? Eating, sleeping, grounding. Angel of soulmates. Yeah, we have somebody new coming in here. Page of cups. You could start off very innocent, but turn into something more, you know, deeper, I guess. More ser more like serious, more spiritual, more loving. But also, somebody could have lost a soulmate. Past lives, angel of health, and soulmates. And if you see these cards, it just looks like somebody may be out there has lost a soulmate and you've been, it's been on your mind a lot lately. Mm. Like lost a soulmate to health health conditions. Soulmates don't have to just be uh, lovers, you know? Soulmates can be family members, friends. So you could have recently lost somebody and you're just reflecting on the past, believing in what's to come next, but you know, healing, letting go of anything that is closing your energy off receiving the divine source being reminded that they're still here with you whoever you lost that's a message for somebody out there they're still here with you spirit wants you to know the more you receive and the more you open up your heart space you will um the more you will like you'll pick up on it <laughs> they're here <laughs> the signs the signs that's what it is the more the signs will come through mm -hmm. okay Anything you want to leave Virgo with? The Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords reverse. It's time for you, Virgo, to be seen. 
The Six of Cups reverse is past lives, King of Swords. Some of you guys are just reflecting on the past as because new connections are here. You're trying to like not find yourself in a repeat of the past. Six of Swords reverse, Five of Cups reverse, Three of Cups. So that could be why maybe you're thinking about the past. But for others of you, it's time for your brilliance and your um, your greatness to be seen. You could have been really hiding yourself away, not allowing your, your energy to be, you know, really seen yet. But now you're stepping up or spirit is kind of leading you down the path of letting it all be seen. Who you are, the brilliant mind that you have, the way that you shine. Some of you guys are very good leaders, decision makers, thinkers, innovative thinkers. Mm. Two of Pentacles reverse and the Ace of Pentacles. I think some of you guys are letting the past go in your mind. If this is like a soulmate thing that didn't work out or something like that, Six of Cups reverse. It's like you're making up your mind to put those thoughts, the healing that you're, you've done. You're like you're, you're finding a way to make space for the new instead of holding on to what once was. And now that's why spirit is pushing you in these new positions or in you know leading you to these new environments these environments of abundance right longevity good connections you're receiving a blessing in the form of communication and connection with spirit about what is going to help you the most moving forward and the opportunities and how to walk into them and step into them and receive them. Virgo, this is what I have for you today. King of Pentacles, great wealth. Um, if you want to follow me on social media, donate to the channel, book personal. Links will be in the description box below or my about tab. I'll see you soon. Bye.